as I was getting ready to start filming this, I realized that I might not have all the supplies to set up my binders for these comeback. But we're doing it anyways. So good, so good. Today, I will be setting up my binders and preparing them for some comebacks that are happening. I don't know why they're happening, but they're happening and we're still locked up inside, which means I'm gonna get these albums really late. But that's fine, we have time to prepare and soak in the actual music of the comeback, which is awesome. But yes, I'm just gonna start with NCT Dream because they are having a comeback. They have had their comeback by the time I'm filming this. So if you're watching this and it's out, which it most likely is out, please stream right in. That song, I already know it's so good. Okay, anyways, let's just get on for channel. There is going to be a glare. I'm sorry about it. I don't know how to fix it. I've tried so many different angles, but this is the best angle I could get. And yes. So, as you can see, the Geno collection has grown. I got his in dream diary thing and i'm planning on getting the other one from empathy i think and um i'm excited for that i'm excited to have this it is an album inclusion so i thought i'd go ahead and collect that and i'm still missing his scratch card rip but yes for general we're just gonna start on the back since he has a full page but um for general the inclusions are so cute, like, oh my gosh, his photo cards are literally, I'm already so excited to get them, and I haven't even seen the album yet, I need to trim these down more, perfect, where was I, yes, so for Geno, I still need his Boom Kino, I don't know if I'm going to buy the Kino itself, or just the photo card, because the photo cards are selling for the exact same price as the Kino, so might as well just get the Kino and see who I pull. Or just buy it with the general photo cards. I don't know yet, I don't know, but I'm planning on getting that soon. And then we have his write-in and roll-in, and then his roll-in, right? But yes, the versions for this are so cute. I only pre-ordered the roll-in version for now because that's all I could afford. Because... There are multiple comebacks happening for some reason at the same time because being a multi is so hard. But yes, we are going to be collecting rolling for now because I pre-ordered that version. And the photo cards for that version are the cutest thing ever. I'm, I actually think I ordered my favorite version first with all the scans that I'm seeing for the full cards. But yes, this is all that we're trying to collect right now for Geno. It's going to be a slow process because I have no idea when these albums are going to get shipped out. Oh, I actually pre-ordered the album along with my Monster X albums. But Monster X are coming back on May 11th, I think. And NCT's Dream have already come back. So these albums are going to get to me really late. But we're fine about it. We're fine. Who doesn't love a haul, okay? Who doesn't love a haul? But yes, this is all we're doing for... Entity Dream. Wavy had a Beyond Live, or are, they're having a Beyond Live, and Yang Yang spoiled something, and he kept saying maybe, and then Henry kept saying maybe, and I feel like they're having another album soon, which means more shouts and photo cards, which also means I actually have to buy more six pocket or nine pocket sleeves, unless I want to start moving these around. Which I kind of don't because I like the layout, but we're going to see about that. Thanks, Yang Yang, for letting me know <laughs> ahead of time. This is such a heavy binder, I swear to God. This binder isn't even full, and it's so heavy, but I'm glad it's not full. <laughs> so for Monster X, they are having a six-member comeback because Wano is no longer in the group for sure now. But he has posted his first selfie on his own account. Wano, I literally cried seeing that selfie. I'm so glad he's back and he's so ready to just start whatever he has planned. And I'm excited for that. I don't know if I'm going to collect his solo things. Maybe. Just maybe. If I'm in the mood. 
but let me try and finish collecting everything else first but yes for monster x their comeback is on may 11th the teaser images as of now as of the time i'm filming this only one version has come out and only four members have been shown but ki hyun looks so good and i ordered version one so we're we're chilling i actually ordered version one three and four three i got signed off of m wave when they were doing their thing i don't know if it, they're all sold out now but i rushed bought one with the little money that i had left and i literally had to ask my dad to put 20 more dollars in my bank account because i am kind of running low on funds but that's happening and i'm so excited for it i have no idea who i'm gonna pull but fingers crossed we're getting ki hyun because if i pulled ki hyun i would literally cry i've been wanting a ki hyun signed album for so long like literally if it wasn't ki hyun signed i would have bought an all member signed album but that's really hard to find these days but for <laughs> if not ki hyun we're gonna ask for juhan or chenkin it's literally 50 percent chance of getting someone that i bias but knowing my luck that's not gonna happen so let's just hope we get some photo cards shall we for this one i didn't mark all the cards just because that's gonna be a lot of ink and a lot of paper wasted so i only marked kihyun so i actually know which version goes where this time instead of having blank ones like this because i would be so confused about which version is which whenever i did it but for fantasia and their versions oh my god there's like paper dust for their versions there are four versions and then they all have one photo card their inclusions are very weird this comeback as well i have no idea how they're gonna do this i kind of have it organized in my head but we will see but they have four versions i'm gonna put this here for now they have four versions and then they all have one photo card per version but if you pre-ordered you also get the unit cards that they're going to have i need to trim these again maybe this is the time where i just need to buy white sleeves you know so i can stop wasting paper and trimming these wrong oh my god these are so bad it's okay they're white pieces of paper it doesn't matter you also get a unit pc when you pre-order and there's like 25 of them and i have no idea if the unit photo cards will be anything like we are here or if they will be like are you there because for one of them i got no photo cards because for units i only collect units that have two of the three people that i collect as you can see over here but since i don't know which one it was i think it was hmm I think it was Are You There? For Are You There, since they literally had like actual units for the photos, like Ki Hyun was always with Min Hyuk, blah blah blah, I didn't get any units with my boys in them together, so I was really sad about that. I really hope they stick to just regular selfie unit cards like this, because I love these so much. And if they don't do that, and I have to collect Juhan and Chang... Oh my god, even if they even if they do that, Juan and Changyun are in a unit now. So I might just have Juan and Changyun units and not collect Kian units. That might be fun. Okay. Okay, Starship. Anyways. So, this is literally my last nine pocket. So, let's hope this doesn't go past anything. But yes, there's those. They have the version... Four, if it will squeeze in here please don't tell me i have to trim you two we're fine we're fine so we have that and then if you ordered off of g market you also got postcards and i don't know oh the postcards are going to be big they didn't include any polaroids this time which is kind of sad but if you ordered off of G Market, you get a member postcard, which means there's going to be three of those. And then you get a 
Why is the garbage truck literally outside right now? I don't know where I left off. But yes, if you order off of G Market, you get a po you get a postcard of a member, which means there's six of them to collect. And then if you order just one album off of G Market, which I didn't because their shipping, because you can only get EMS from Korea right now, is so expensive. So rip to those. I'm going to have to buy those separately. But if you ordered off of G Market, you can either get a Polaroid, if you a Polaroid, oh my god, postcard which is member specific or you get a bookmark which is member specific and I don't know what size the bookmarks will be I have no idea if they're gonna fit in these kind of pockets or if they're gonna have to go in three pockets or something like that because I am out of why am I putting these in here I'm out of flipping paper so what's the point and I'm just gonna put them with the three pockets right now but there's gonna be those and then I have no idea if they're gonna have group cards. I really hope they have group cards because if they just stop having group cards now, I'm gonna be really sad. But what Starship also mentioned is that they're gonna also have standees. Why am I putting this here? They are going to have standees, but they call them triangle standees. And I'm really, really hoping they're not a too bad of a, a regular shape. Oh my god, Kikian, what are you doing? I really hope they're not that irregular shaped because if they're like the have you seen god sevens triangle photo card insert things holy cow if i had to squeeze those in here i would cry like sorry god seven collectors but the struggle is real to find pocket sleeves that will fit those and if you collect more than one member holy cow but i really wish they would stick with these these are so nice but apparently they're gonna have those i'm not gonna mark them because this is the actual, this is the marker for me. An empty sleeve, like something has to go in here. And the only thing that would fit would be the standees. So I'm going to put the standees here. And then for the rest, we are going to use, oh my god, these are my trade things. We are going to use a three pocket for the postcard and the bookmarks i'm just gonna put the bookmarks on the back i think that's all that they have for inclusions right now it is a lot to collect but it also is not that intimidating just because i don't feel like that it's a lot to collect compared to what else what else wants the excess put out but this oh my gosh they have kinos starship why did you start making kinos if you make a kino for every comeback that's another like $30 that I have to spend on buying a Kino and they always come with full members They always come with full member sets of pulse cards and things like that So it's cheaper for me to buy the entire Kino than buy Kihan set, Juhan set, and Changhyun set separately So and I'm already like getting these group things going on So might as well start doing that but yes, we're going to have to find a Kino page. I'm out of nine pocket sleeves, so we might have to start double siding. I really don't want to. The backs are really cute on these cards. But if it comes to that, I might double page these to have room for the Kino. Or I could just buy more sleeves, but I don't have money. Yeah, this is very confusing right now, <laughs> but we'll figure out the Kino when I actually buy the Kino, you know? Well, we'll figure it out when it gets there. When it gets there. Oh, if that happens, that means I have to get... That means I have to save pages for the Kino postcard things. I don't know how much they're going to include. They had three last time. I don't know if they're still going to have three this time. Because it's an even number of people. There might be, like... No, it's not five per member. That'd be weird. There might be. Actually, they might have three and then a group card. That might be 25. Enough with the math. We'll think about that later when we have the Kino. But that is it for organizing for this comeback. I realized a lot of things. That y'all should stream writing by NCT Dream. But also that there's going to be a lot to collect again and i'm excited to get back into collecting everything like fast paced and stuff like that it's really exciting 
but I'm also excited for the comebacks. I'm excited for the teaser images. I'm really excited for what the song sounds like just because the whole teaser things that the teasers that they're giving out gives me drama rama vibes. And drama rama was peak era for me. I love drama rama with all my heart. That's literally my favorite era ever. But yes, we're just gonna leave it at it as is. It for this video, I guess. Thank you guys so much for watching this. I'll probably see you in another video, but I'll see y'all then. Okay, bye now.